So breaking tonight, a woman collapses here in the courtroom after she is convicted of killing a couple and their unborn child in an argument over hair weave. WMC Action News 5's Janice Broach is live downtown with the other dramatic moments from that verdict. Janice. Well, it took jurors only a few hours to convict 19-year-old Shelby Isaac in the murders of a pregnant woman and her boyfriend. The teenager fainted after the first verdict was read. The reads we, the jury, find the defendant guilty of second-degree murder. When Judge James Lammy started reading the verdicts, 19-year-old Shelby Isaac put her head down. As he continued to read the verdicts for the other counts, Isaac fainted and was on the ground for at least five minutes. As deputies tried to revive her, they finally got her up and out of the courtroom as her family erupted in cries. Jurors also began to cry as the judge read the verdicts. Two counts of second-degree murder in the death of last January of Edwina Thomas and her boyfriend, Eddie Tate, and a conviction in the death of Thomas's unborn child. I mean, it was a reasonable verdict. We was obviously seeking a murder in the first degree, but the jury decided, I don't, I don't know what factors they used, but maybe her age could have been a factor. In Isaac's family left the courtroom in tears. The victims were shot in an apartment complex over the purchase of hair weaves. Shelby has maintained that she was not guilty of this from day one. The victim's families left the courtroom without commenting. An ambulance was called for Shelby Isaac. We do not know her condition. Now, she is scheduled to be sentenced on December 15th. She faces up to 25 years behind bars on one second-degree murder conviction. Live downtown, Janice Broach, WMC Action News 5. More